Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing another command block tutorial, as it's been a week since my last one. I've been working off camera on some of the projects that you might see in the future. Last video wasn't much of a command block one, but today I'm going to... I think make a boss bar. So I'll show you the general making a boss bar stuff. First, you're going to want a boss bar. So you do slash boss bar. Add. And then put in your boss bar. So ID horse. And then the name. You have to put this here. Horse boss. And now you've got a custom boss bar called horse boss. So, boss bar, get Minecraft horse, uh, I meant set, set Minecraft horse, value to, how, how much health does a horse have? Uh, I guess I'll just put it to 100 to make a custom horse. So custom horse. Uh, what is the? I'm gonna put the custom horse and then boss bar set. Minecraft horse. Style, not twenty. Color. Too bad you can't put it in any custom one. I think I'm going to do green. Players. So to put a uh, custom boss bar on something, you're going to want your item first. So what I'm going to be using is... MC Stacker for Minecraft 1.20. And I'm going to give myself a horse with a max health of 100 and a health of 100. And I'll paste that in. I might want, and I'll put a tag in it first. And I'll put it to be dark brown with black dots. Because I feel like that's a cool in the horse. And I'll give it the tag of boss. Horse boss. Copy this. And this is our horse boss. I have to get rid of this old one. There it is. Dark brown with black dots. Yeah, this is from the other video I did. And... Slash... Execute... As at a tag equals horse boss store result boss bar Minecraft horse value and then run data get entity at self I think it's health so this is the command you're gonna want for your uh, 
horse boss bar. As you can see, I'm using it. The I'm replacing the old command. This is the command for the horse data pack thing. So I go to data functions tick. And I paste in this. And I can save that. Get rid of these two tests. But then you'll notice that the boss bar doesn't show up for anybody on here. Well, that is because I have to execute as the horse boss. As all the player, the players with a distance with dot dot, and I'll put it 80. Run boss bar set Minecraft horse. visible to true uh -huh. to all the players within 80 blocks of this uh -huh. and I'll do that to I'll do the opposite to 80 and beyond I'll make it false 81 uh -huh. and beyond I think uh -huh. is a better one but then you're gonna want to Execute as at A run boss bar add. I mean, not run boss bar add, run boss bar set players. Let me just copy this and make sure I'm writing it correctly. Set players. Set. Oh man, I was setting it wrong. Minecraft horse players at A. And I copied just this. I don't need all that. And if I save this, reload, I should get a boss bar. Boss bar set Minecraft horse players itself. Hmm. Uh -huh. The visible true. Oh, that's weird. <coughs> Execute as app at, at so at itself. Never forget this. I do that a lot though, so you can forget it if you want. I mean, I'm not going to stop you. And now I've got a boss bar. And as you can see, the boss bar is already working. But now you'll have, you'll notice, uh, it's still there. This is because we're executing it as the horse boss instead of at the players. So what we should have done here, I mean, what I should have done is I'm going to copy these two, paste it here, take the as at e tag equals horse boss, copy this.
So if I undo all of this, if I get rid of this and put a comma here, get rid of this and put a comma here, as at a tag equals horse boss, distance, yeah, then bam, you got that, and at player, at a, you've got to make sure it's at a. And you get rid of that last one, and you go back. If you reload now, the horse boss should have disappeared. Execute as at A, at itself. If. Entity I get confused sometimes Execute as at a at itself if there's an entity With the tag of horse boss Make it visible If I copy this maybe and replace this and replace the if with unless false ah there it worked and now since I've got my horse boss spawn egg Wait a second, that's not the horse boss spawn egg. That's the normal horse spawn egg. So, yeah, I've got the horse spawn. So you can see I've got the horse boss spawn egg. And you can have as many uh, different boss bars as you want. This one doesn't look very good, as you can see. And you can even heal them up. It works both ways. Where's a regen? I need healing. I almost grabbed harming. <laughs> You can just heal up your horse. Yeah, that's how you get the horse boss. And the best part is, it doesn't even have to be a horse. But if you go out of. If you go 80 blocks away, then the boss bar goes away. Which is like my render distance right now. Make sure to subscribe if you want. I'm probably going to do more videos like this. Where I do command block stuff. If you have any idea what I should do next, you can put it in the comments. <laughs> I do enjoy use doing a lot of horse-based command block stuff. But that's how you do a boss bar. There are videos on there if you want to make custom, like boss bar stuff like custom colors and stuff like that so if I go in here I can make tick copy and paste and I can rename it with Load, load, 
then I can make a new function called load.mc function load.mc function where I can put all of the boss bar commands Oh, MCFUNCT. Oh, that's not function. Okay, boss bar or add horse, horse boss. And then I can go like horse color green, style notch, value 100. I can copy that, paste it here. Then I can go back to style notched 20 and put that into load. And the last one, uh, color green and I can put that there and then I have to get rid of the uh, slash and I've got a whole eight commands to make a bo custom boss bar that can look what it like whatever I want it to so if I wanted the color like purple I could do that and I could have it like style progress and cool dude I if I wanted I could reload this and I could do slash boss bar remove minecraft horse and then slash reload and instead I'd have cool dude so that's gonna be it for this video I'll, I might see you next time might not but see you later